Hi, Rick Lisa. Nick. Nick. Nick, Nick. He, he leads a rough life. Yes, he does. So we're walking on the rail trail, right? We do that a lot, the by other the way. Day. Yeah. And I had to, they have a spot a pot, which I appreciate that. I know you use it a lot. Yes, I do. Nobody likes you. We had to go in the things. bushes before before they pot uh, the. Uh, I'll go anywhere. I, okay? I know you will. But now in the day of cameras, yeah, you don't go anywhere. If you want to go viral, then you go anywhere. Anyway, so um, I'm like I don't touch anything. You know, you know me. I don't touch anything in those things. I even use something to open the door. Right. They're kind of gross. No matter how clean they are. They're still gross. If if you get them like when they just delivered, you still have that blue liquid right. in it. But anybody christens it, it's all over. But you look over. down there. You look down there. I try to. Shouldn't look down there. I, no, I just try to keep my head up and my, yeah. Yeah, that. Yeah. Well, I look down there. Anyway, so I had one of those fanny packs with the water and everything, my mm -hmm. phone. I actually had two waters and I had one like shoved in there. So I'm doing my stuff, right? Mm -hmm. And all of a sudden my water bottle starts to fall no oh my goodness hit the ground so it made me think the grossest place you drop something and for me that came pretty darn close i mean that is gross but because it's hot <laughs> and i need water i used it ordinarily i probably would have tossed it, it but it wasn't on the inside of the bottle nonetheless it's the whole bottle the top ew, 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 you guys i think you're one of these type of people that over exaggerate some things and aren't paying attention to stuff that really is bad anyway <laughs> anyway so the grossest place you ever dropped something tell us Ooh, I, it'd have to be hard to because you know uh, those porta potties it's like what are they they uh uh, freshen them up once a year they're gross <laughs> but so it's like the national guard stop by it's in all fairness it's hard to keep them clean mm -hmm. um i know businesses try that deliver those things try to keep them clean but when you have pigs like us <laughs> well <clears throat> going in and using them since we're on the subject of, of urination <laughs> one thing that really uh bothered me uh, a number of years ago we were in in uh, europe we did a couple of vacations yeah. there and they pay for, like every toilet there is a pay toilet right that shouldn't be except they do have some like urinals that you can use because i actually used a urinal in an emergency one time you don't care where you go do you? no where i you go, go anywhere all right I also mm -hmm. before you wrap it up but we, we want to know where the grossest place you dropped something it could be the gross trash i dropped my keys in the toilet one time which didn't ha it only had number one not two and but it's so gross right because it was at yeah. uh, sheets or something so, but i had to fetch them out ew that's gross well i uh, i one time dropped my uh smartphone in the toilet not so smart not really uh, but i pulled it fortunately it hadn't one or had, two didn't have any no it didn't have any it was it was a clear bowl still gross right but i pulled it out there and it, it, it worked i didn't have to you know do oh, anything to oh, it good good so tell <laughs> tell us in the comments the grossest place you drop something we hope to see you again same bat time same bat channel